I actually reworked the mine entrance a bit too. I'll have to show you guys that in a little bit whenever it's daytime. We'll have to build Matt a, uh, a bed still at some point. Mm. Uh, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. We, you, no, you've got a nice on. sofa out by the fire pit. I'll just leave it out there. <laughs> we don't need a. Do we need circuits? We don't need circuits for this. We don't need circuits for this. I feel like I built three of these the last episode. I have no idea. These work. <laughs> this is the trouble with you going out to get married and forgetting how everything, everything. works. <coughs> yep, forgetting all things, all the things. Which but, which thing are you trying to make? Um, most of them. <laughs> most of them. <laughs> okay, well, so looks you, like you need well, lots so, of bronze uh, the plates. The forge hammer. The forge hammer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yep. So you can use a bronze, aluminum, or iron machine hole, a brass machine hole. Yep. I'd say uh, you should be able to make like an iron machine hole. You should be able to do that pretty easily with just eight iron plates around a wrench. say so. Uh, I do. I uh, say so. Yeah. <laughs> and then, yeah, we should still have our file somewhere, so if maybe Matt can work on the bronze gears and the piston while Seth tries to get the iron Break machine things. hole. I don't see... Oh. No, no, no. What is it? R? Balls. How do you do that again? You, you don't click on it. You... Don't right-click on it. You screw it. You said eight iron plates. I'll just go get plates. Eight iron plates. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, that's that's the trouble with well, you playing, playing <laughs> mod games with you and Matt. I know you've been out of the modded Minecraft game for a while too, so you're trying to kind of get back up to speed on things because you knew industrial craft, but you hadn't really played Greg Tech before at all. Yeah. Um, no, Greg Tech I had generally avoided. <laughs> <laughs> uh, after ten episodes, I, you know, <clears throat> agree with you. <laughs> no, actually, I, I can't say that. It, it's a lot of fun. It's just uh, very annoying. <laughs> uh, yeah, the, the needing diamonds for lots of fairly early stuff that, you know, in, in other mods you don't really need it for. <laughs> yeah, it certainly makes sense. <laughs> Makes a bit of a change. Hey, basic machine casing. You got one? Perfect. Yeah, is that the same thing as an iron machine hole? Correct. Um, sure, why not? That's true. <laughs> I only speak the truth. Well, just like the uh, Zatar from Moulin Rouge. The what? The singing Zatar, dancing Zatar. Have you seen Moulin Rouge? No. Ah, oh. <laughs> I know, I'm a bad person. You are bad. All right. Technologist's over. Thanks for watching, folks. We're going to go watch Moulin Rouge. We've been the technologist. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> it really is a good movie. Oh, I, I believe you. Yeah, there's Let's singing. Uh, there's dancing. All singing, all dancing. Um, bronze is copper and tin, right? Okay. That goes there. Those go there. And, and we get bronze dust. Three bronze dust. Correct. In our uh, dust, in our... <laughs> Smell tree. <laughs> three, three copper dust and one tin dust. Definitely gonna have to load us up with some more weapons and armor. And there's me in the smeltery, right? Three in copper the... dust, one tin dust. Yeah. So I do have to grind the ingots. Correct. And what were you gonna say, Matt? Nothing at the moment. I'm just trying oh, to figure yeah. out how to how to make these bronze rods. Uh, so we should have an iron file. Where did we stick our file? It's in my hands. Okay, give give <laughs> yeah, give Matt your file. <laughs> Matt, turn around. <laughs> ah, thank you. All right, and then yeah, you should be able to use that guy to make the rods. Okay. Uh, do y'all have more bronze ingots? Oh, no, that's what I'm pretending like I'm making now. Did you already uh -huh. use the bronze ingots? In, well, I, oh, yeah. I, I I grabbed the entire Good. stack of them. Uh, <laughs> what? Okay. That's where they went. Hey, can I have some of those? Uh, well, I've got or, 13 left. I'm about oh. to use eight of them. Hold on. What are you making? <laughs> uh, <laughs> make sure we're not overlapping here. Yeah, exactly. What are you uh, making again? So I was making the gears and the uh, piston for, for the... For the forge hammer? Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Okay. Um, 
Okay, do you want to make the... Alright, that's fine. You do that, and I'll I'll make the four plates that go around it. <coughs> okay. Um, hmm. Yeah. But I do need to turn this copper into dust and make a new mortar and pestle. Unless you made another one of those somewhere. I have not. So yeah, if we need a mortar and pestle. Stone bricks and iron. Or do I have iron? Hmm, okay, let's see here. Uh, no. I need... I'm getting a lot of lag down here. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm getting a decent amount of lag, too. I'm not quite sure what's... going the culprit. Maybe, uh... Something for another day. Yeah, we'll see how badly it affects our our stuff. Um. <laughs> uh, it's just uh, I'm standing here, just watching both you guys face down at the crafting tables, <laughs> <laughs> bent over stuff. Oh. It's, that's Great. the troubles. It's Great so easy. Success. Yeah. <laughs> nice. You got got your gears? Oh yeah, two gears. You know what Excellent. really grinds my gears? <laughs> wow. <laughs> um, Seth, you still have that bucket? Uh yes. Okay, I need to go off on a bucket quest. Bucket! 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 Okay. Oh wait, oh, wait, wait, no, 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 hold on. So I take this and then I come over here to the. This is really annoying. Is there a way to turn off sounds in Greg Tech? Um, <laughs> Aside from turning off sounds. Uh, turning off sounds. There might be something in like the Greg Tech config files, but beyond that, not really. Hey, so, hey yeah. Seth. Yo. Uh, in this middle workbench, I put the gears in there, so start putting the stuff in there as I get it. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna put the machine casing in there, and uh, shoot, what else? What's in the middle? Oh, the wrench. I can throw the wrench in there, too. Alright. There you go. So, now back to this and figure out why this is not working. <clears throat> okay, so how do the better barrels actually work? Because I basically kept clicking on the, the one with the ingots I needed until it shot all of them at me. <laughs> if you, <laughs> if shift. you shift left click. Yep, it'll get a single. Ah, gotcha. Okay. Yep. Cool. All right, uh, Chris, tell me again what I do with this dust. Oh, my gosh. So th <laughs> <laughs> three copper dust and one tin dust and the steam. Three copper dust and one tin dust and the steam. steam and the furnace? steam. Steam. Steam smeltery. Steam. Okay, see, there's a difference. Yeah. You said three in one and two in the other. Uh, no, three, three copper dust and one, um, one tin dust. <clears throat> okay. Um. So, uh, when that doesn't work. Yeah, it was weird. I was trying to do something with the steam furnace earlier, and it didn't seem to be going. It's almost as if. You know, for some reason our things aren't connected up right, which doesn't make any sense at all. Yeah, because I didn't do it. <laughs> exactly, yeah. <laughs> well, yep, let's just I'm, be honest here. I'm very concerned about my own work, because I double-checked the pipes underneath, and it seemed like everything was connected up all right. So, so you, you knew this was a problem, and you let me go ahead and do it, and, <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. and think it was my fault. That Pretty much. Pretty much. Do you know if steam can come out the bottom? Oh, that's that's probably it. I think it has to come out the side now that you mention it. Yes, that's exactly it. Yep. yep. Well, look at you being the smart one. <laughs> uh, hold on, what happened to that wrench? Uh, I need the wrench back. I like how there are just the remains of trees floating out here. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, it's, it's the most annoying thing that I tend to do, but despite being annoyed by it, I continue doing it. The, like, half cutting down a tree and leaving the top part of it. So you don't top the tree, you bottom the tree. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> So Matt, you said that you had looked up this war of mine recently? Uh yeah, I saw it was on something, I don't remember what it was, but uh they had the I guess the preview video for it and it looked fascinating. I didn't realize it was supposed to be like a side scrolling type thing. Yeah. Oh man. Yeah, what a interesting, depressing game. <laughs> huh. Oh yeah, that looked really depressing yeah it's i've been playing all day i'm surprised that i'm still you know just oh. as happy and go lucky as i am <laughs> it looks like a good game it's single player right it is yep I, i'd like to try to start a series of that sometime soon actually given the chance um we'll have to see um what kind of free time i have because yeah oh. still trying to do the sunless sea videos here and there just to add a little bit more stuff to our our channel Mm -hmm. A little bit of variety. That's something not just Minecraft. Sure. Uh, what's the... Oh, it just needed to wait for a little bit. Sure, whatever. <laughs> it made four and then it just stopped. <laughs> nice. So the steam-powered forge hammer is basically the bronze hammer that we use, but just done via steam. So that way we don't have to use up our hammer in order to make things like the, the plates. Hey Seth, how many plates have you made? Hush your mouth. <laughs> uh, I'm still working on making the bronze. Unfortunately, uh, what we have found, or I guess Chris knew this, uh, I didn't. Uh, the Greg Tech stuff, the, especially the, the Steam stuff, mm -hmm. is more efficient than doing it um, like in a furnace or whatnot. Mm -hmm. But it is about 4,000 times slower. <laughs> yep. So at this point, I've made four ingots. I'm waiting for another four, and then I'll be able to make uh, four plates, I think. Okay. Because it's two ingots per plate. Yeah. Yeah, because it looks like at this point... I'm that's... not going to get into too much of the advanced math, because... <laughs> And math. Man, there's a bunch of ore berries that I'm missing, and in fact, there's apparently a an essence ore berry I need to track down at some point because Mrs. Halama was saying that I I needed to go get it, but I have no idea where it's at anymore. And she's oh gonna, yeah, it's yeah, she's gonna be annoyed that, that I'm missing the others. But we've got comments. Exactly. Yep. <laughs> we've made friends. <laughs> oh man. Holy crap! All right, Matthew. Yes. Would you please come look at the crafting station? Is it ready? It's... Uh, we'll let you <laughs> take it out there. Oh, look at that. It's lovely. <laughs> yeah, go ahead and pull that out, and let's set it over here. I guess this there should be a sign for where we were hoping to stick it. But we'll have to add more bronze. Yeah, I'm doing that. Okay, perfect. Did we already have more bronze fluid pipes to use? Yeah, I had four of them in my oh, inventory. Perfect. Probably not the last time. All right, so there you go. Plop it down right on top of that. Now, no. one. Th oh crap. <laughs> uh, one thing that I read on the Greg Tech site. Yes, Chris, I actually did some reading. What? The <laughs> no. uh, you're gonna come down here and think this is uh, fairly terrible looking, but I don't really care. Uh, <laughs> <clears throat> the thing is, this steam boiler, small coal boiler over here, Matt, is mm -hmm. apparently uh, strong enough to run one machine at full speed. Uh, and apparently only certain machines at full speed. Huh. So uh, take into account the fact that these are really slow as it is, and then uh, the fact that this guy can't even handle more than one of them at a time, so... You know, yeah, that's fun, the, fun times with Greg Tech. The <laughs> beauty of either adding more or upgrading it to like the high pressure steam boiler later on once we start making steel. But usually I think it's these Java barrels that are lagging. Uh, yeah. Knock out the Java barrels, then go ahead and just axe them all up. Toss all the. Well, well, we can do that later. I think it'll be fine. 
but every time I look at them, it either that or it's all these railcraft lamps. I well, no, because I've I've been out in the mine for a while and I've been kind of lagging. So uh, have you been? Not entirely unconvinced that it's not X two sixty four. Eh, could be ten eighty Minecraft. The technologists are experimenting with technology. <laughs> yeah, guys, this will be our first. Uh, this will be our first session where we're actually recording in ten eighty. So that what could be a little the... bit of it, but. My frame rates are pretty good for 1080. 